Okay, everyone, if you don't have uh, all five ideas, that's fine. Let's just move on to see what maybe some people are thinking. So this will also be to take roles. So we'll just start at the end of the row. We'll just go up and down. Uh, so what you want to do is just uh, tell me your name and then an idea or two that you have from the list. So we'll start here at the very end with Jose. With Jose. With Joe. With Jose, with Joe, uh, can you just mention an idea or two? So tell the class your name, and then we'll go maybe an idea or two. Okay, my name is Jose Reese. Jose Reese, twenty. Uh, well, I was trying to find an event to attend on September twenty-five. It's after the day. Uh, we have an event uh, next. Uh, we want to have an event next Saturday nineteen. Uh, so thank you, Jose. It's a community event. Uh, Health event. There's going to be a uh, uh, certain amount of registration for uh, health care, giving information, doing uh, mammograms for women, mm -hmm. and uh, the sensory um, mobile clinic and uh, some organizations for giving information about immigration uh, level. Uh, Issues and, uh, like that. Well, it sounds pretty interesting and full featured. And you said that's going to be on the nineteenth. Yes. Very good. Is it, does it have? Do you know if there's a hashtag associated with it already? If if you're associated with it in any way, maybe you can think of a of a of a hashtag to 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 give them. You know, to tie all of these tweets together. So uh, just off the top of my head, it might not be the best one, but maybe we could do uh, S Y H E. Uh, I don't know. Does the event have an official name? You know, you can use the initials. Uh, right here, I just thought of San Isidro Health Event. That might not be the right name, but just some hashtag with the initials of the event. That way, people can tie together concepts. Probably will be S Y F M H E. Mm -hmm. Sure. Yeah. No, knows about that, but. Uh, the initial for the business and then they Yeah. All you have to do is use it on your accounts and get other accounts to use it and maybe put it on a flyer or write it on the wall or something and then that'll start to get traction for it. Okay, so very cool. I can suggest them just in their comments. Okay. Very good. Thank you. Next person. Steve? Yes? Um game Raiders and Ravens and then uh, London Fashion next week. Oh, okay. So the Raiders game, boo, and uh, London Fashion Week. I think they have a hashtag, don't they? Like uh, London Fashion Week, L yeah, LFW. Yeah. London Fashion Week. London New York, London yeah. Okay, good. So those are some events coming up uh, within this within this week, actually? Yeah. Yeah, actually, yeah. All right, very good. So definitely, that's going to give you a lot of uh, a lot of people passionate about both of those opposite sides of the spectrum. Definitely, but uh, you're going to tap into some good people, and good tweets and such. Okay, very good. Uh, next. Um, I was thinking of Boo, the festival is happening this weekend. What's the name of the festival? The Boo, K A A B O. K A A B O. I don't. I don't know that one. What? What is what is it about? It's happening at the Del Mar Fairgrounds for three days, and there's so many performing there. Okay, so it's a music it's a music event. It's a music oh. oh, cool! So kind of full featured. Does that have a hashtag? Do you know? Most likely, yeah. yeah. And probably like individual bands or food vendors have their own hashtag as well. So yeah, that's that's going to be pretty rich. And what were the dates on that again? Or when is it happening? Soon. Uh, Chris Brown's performing tomorrow. Mm. Oh, cool. And Kevin Hart on Saturday. Cool. I think that's at mm -hmm. so It's going to be multi-locations, too. All right, very cool. Yeah, and then the 
Okay, cool. Next. Uh, okay. No, not, not yet. Um, that was her idea. Uh, what about yours? Me? Yeah. No, but she said it first. No, that was She said it. Yeah, she was. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> my angle here, because this light's right in my face. Okay, Pablo. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> because, uh, well, the page that I try to do is about lawyers and stuff. So there's no events related to that. Do they still play Judge Judy on TV? Well, I was going to put something with uh, debate. But I don't know if that's okay or not. The presidential debate? Yeah. Uh, sure, if it's, you know, what kind of law is it going on? I, I know they're probably going to bring up immigration and other such issues during these debates. I don't know what kind of law really you're working with. So maybe you could find topics to pull out of the debate to, to tweet about. Sure. Mm -hmm. Okay. That's probably oh, kind of complicated, but I'm trying to do the research. Sure, definitely just idea to to get started. Okay, good. Uh, next. Uh, yeah, we'll go. Sure. My name is Claudio, and I'm tweeting about next Monday. Or I'm going to reply to this tweet, comment on it. It's supposed to be the catastrophe. Uh, it happens next Wednesday. It's supposed to be the Hashtag end of the world. <laughs> Hashtag the end. This guy is Kenji at Kenji Game of Pro. That's it. Interesting, so I've got a video uploaded on things that might possibly happen. Okay. So well. we don't need to do the, the homework. <laughs> we'll, we'll see when the comet hits because it still might be due. <laughs> if the comet hits after 11 p.m., you still have to do your homework. <laughs> the meteor. Okay, well, uh, some sort of uh, meteorological event might happen. Even if it doesn't happen, then people are probably still going to tweet about it because people notice this stuff and uh, and everyone kind of talks about it so okay the meteor event hashtag meteor and yes my name is Alexander Barra and I'll be live tweeting the uh, yeah, cooking channel's uh, TV show called Unique Sweets where episodes get to portray excellent European sweets starting at not, yeah, start, yeah, starting at 11 p.m. Mm. And I'll be showing that on the 19th. Hmm. Okay, very good. So definitely uh, TV events and such and, and food. Uh, and TV cupcake show. Wars, too, which is magical cupcakes. Cupcake Wars, okay. <laughs> so here we go. We're getting lots of ideas. If you didn't have your own idea, here's some coming up here. So here, this quick activity was just to kind of give us ideas that you know, I have this assignment. You're going to live tweet and then right away, well, what does that mean or what do I do? Here we're, we're putting it all together with the examples I was giving earlier of the hashtags and here now with you yourself kind of thinking a little bit about it and collaborating and hearing other people. There's plenty of things then that could be live that you could then tweet about to be a part of it. The funny thing is that, uh, maybe I shouldn't even say this, but the funny thing is I read an article about someone that was not at this event at all but live tweeted it and everyone believed he was at it because he was reading other people's tweets and adding to them and just really acting and retweeting photos and just making it all up like he went to this event and everyone believed him, his friends and family and he was like, no, I was, I was at home so I'm telling you that, but don't do that uh, do it for real so again, with Twitter or with any other social network, basically. It's all about uh, doing it, about uh, practicing it, uh, making mistakes, getting better. How many of you uh, since since Monday have uh, tweeted anything? Since, since Monday, okay. 10 points for you, minus 10 for everyone else. 
how many how many of you have uh, have uh, maybe downloaded the app or have the app on your device? Okay, very good. Uh, for for Twitter, yeah. LinkedIn, you're getting ready. Yeah. Yeah, all of these networks have an app now, and sometimes the there's only an app, not a website, kind of like Instagram. And when we get to that for a long time, Instagram was only an app. You couldn't access it on the website. But um, so the point is, you, you want to do it, um, try it, make mistakes, learn from your mistakes and such. And uh, that's how you, you get good at any social network. Uh, so we're going to end the lecture in a moment. But um, I guess let me, uh, I, I didn't pull it up, but uh, let me pull up the homework assignment just to mention any details about it, and then we'll, we'll have time to work. Let's see, so the homework assignment should be there under the assignments section of Blackboard now. We'll take a quick look here if you would like. The Twitter assignment, you need to create a profile. Everyone should have already done that. We did it together. Plan on live tweeting an event between today and next week. I've got a link here also on my company's blog about some Twitter tips. So you want to check out that, that blog post at some point, follow that link. And then uh, your actual tasks, of course, you're going to need to fill in your profile as complete as possible so that you don't look like a spammer. Um, you're going to be tracking in your analytics account, your Excel document. You're going to be tracking your followers and such. So if you just created the account, you have zero followers. But have, hopefully at the after you know next Monday and you check again your, your statistics here for... Uh, for following, hopefully you have more than zero, and you're going to add that value to your spreadsheet, and then every Monday uh, you should check it, uh, which also reminds me, let's, let's do one thing here. On Twitter, if you're on Twitter and you click on the uh, your icon at the top right, your profile icon, click on that. How many of you see in this menu here something that's called analytics? Raise your hand. Does anyone see analytics in that little menu? Uh, nope. Okay. Well, here's what you want to do. If you don't see it in the menu, you can access it like this. If you go to analytics.twitter.com, let's try this. Let's go to analytics.twitter.com, and this, what, we'll, what it'll do is it'll show you statistics. That's just a fancy name. Statistics and data. It'll show you how many followers you've gotten, what your popular tweets have been, that sort of thing. A N a l y t i c s dot twitter dot com analytics dot com analytics dot twitter dot com. So this will just show you various charts, like uh, various things. Impressions. Impressions are how many times someone saw your tweet. Profile visits. That's self-explanatory. How many times people visited your profile. How many followers. So two. Uh, two followers were added within this time period, 28 days. And you can see you can see other stats, popular tweets, what happened in August, top followers, which tweets had activity, Ooh, we lost one follower at that point there, 12 profile visits, Etc. So this is at analytics.twitter.com. Just much more data, and you can look at the top also for more details. Tweets, followers. This is pretty cool under followers. It'll tell you people that follow you are more interested in this or that. So once you know that, you can you can add tweets about a particular uh, topic. With a brand new account, there might not be anything here yet because it's a brand new account. So as you use as you use this live tweet uh, opportunity, you want to check here your analytics for it to give you information. 
analytics.twitter.com. Back on the homework, uh, you're going to track your followers. Uh, in order for me to know about your account, you need to follow my account. I have a Twitter account right here, SWC, uh, SWC Victor Campos. You need to follow that account so that I know that yours exists, so that it can give you a grade. Yeah, right here, SWC Victor Campos. You need to follow that and then follow at least 10 other Twitter profiles related to your business. So don't just randomly follow. You know, Taylor Swift doesn't need another follower. Kanye West doesn't need another follower. You want to follow other accounts related to what your company is about and how to find followers. You do the search up at the top. And I said here, on the day of the TV event, but, you know, I'm making it so any, any live event, on the day of the live event, spend time live tweeting, which will be use Twitter search to view all tweets on the event's hashtag. Uh, you want to tweet text or pictures or video or links content to the people that are also live tweeting, and you may follow them. You know, if you're seeing who's tweeting on a particular hashtag, you care about that hashtag, they care about that hashtag. If you follow them, they might follow you. That's how you start to build followers. If you reply to people, they might follow you. If you retweet people, they might follow you. So you're going to be social in a social network. Uh, on any other day, people always forget this one and then they ask, why did I not get perfect 10 points? Number six, on any other day besides the TV event, tweet a link to my Twitter tips blog post. The one that I mentioned up here on number three, you want to go read those tips and at some point tweet that link. So if you do all of this but forget that part, you might not get a perfect 10 points. And then your analytics begin tracking your followers every Monday. By the due date, be sure that you're following. Also, make sure you follow my account. Simply sending me your email might not uh, alert me that you followed me to, to grade you. So you'll be graded on your ability to set up Twitter and complete the tasks. And it's due a week from today, 11 p.m. You have a week to figure out a live event tweet about it, make sure you follow those steps, and then you'll get, you'll get your grade. Any questions on the Twitter assignment? All right, so I recommend you do check out that link and tweet it at some point. That's part of the assignment. So we'll have some lab time now. Uh, if you need any individual help and such, call me over. I'll help you out. And uh, the assignment that was due on Monday, uh, LinkedIn, I, I haven't gotten to grading them all yet. Uh, if you haven't turned it in, you can still turn it in to get some points. So that's it for the moment. Remember to check out the videos if you, uh, if you need them.